Hello viewers, I hope you are all well. Welcome to my channel Study for Competitive. I am Shankar and now I am going to discuss the important current affairs of 9th August. If you don't subscribe my channel still now, please subscribe it and also press the bell icon. So without wasting a little time, let's start. First, we will discuss about important day. World Tribal Day or International Day of the World Indigenous People is celebrated by United Nations and other world organizations. The day promotes and protects the rights of world indigenous population. This year, World Tribal Day's theme is COVID-19 and indigenous people resilience. Next, we will discuss about national. The Indian Railways is to operate first parcel special train to Bangladesh under Ahmedabad Division. The train from the Western Railway Zone is to carry denim cloth, dyes, and colors from Gujarat to Benapur in Bangladesh. Next, the Prime Minister of India, Narendra Modi, will inaugurate a 2300km subferring optical fiber cable that will connect from Chennai to both player of Andaman and Nicobar. The submarine cable will also connect major islands in Andaman such as Heplok, Kar Nicobar, Great Nicobar, Kamurta, Rangat and Little Andaman. The connectivity will provide faster and reliable mobile telecom service to Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Next, United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organization, UNESCO, recognizes the two coastal villages of Urisha as tsunami ready for their overall preparedness to face the tsunami. And the two villages are Venkatrai Port and Nolia Shahi. Urisha became the first state in the Indian Ocean region to achieve the status of tsunami ready from the Intergovernmental Oceanographic Commission IOC of UNESCO. Next, we will look into the topic of international. The former president of Sri Lanka, Sri Mahinda Rajapakse, was sworn in as the new Prime Minister of Sri Lanka. Next, we will discuss about report. The MB States India 2020 report is released by the National Statistical Office. According to the report, the number of heat wave days in 2019 increased over 80%. Ministry of Statistics and Program Implementation has prepared this report. Next, we will discuss about Defense. Defense Minister Rajnath Singh announced that India has put ban on 101 defense items to boost indigenous production. The list item was prepared by Defense Ministry. This step is taken to make India self-reliant under Akma Nirbhar Bharat Abhiyan. Finally, we have come to the end of the video. If you want PDF of this video, please go to my site www.studyforcompetitive.weblink.com So, like my video, share it and don't forget to subscribe my channel. Thank you.